Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you a project share on Chaos Craft August release. It's a pretty big release and um, a lot of these projects span from the theme of fall to winter and uh, you can find these metal die sets at AliExpress Chaos Craft or Chaos Craft Amazon. Uh, let's get started. First off, we have this pumpkin pale um, pumpkin basket mini album. It comes with this candy word shadow die and these flowers are also from the August release but it's um, a separate metal die set for um, just these. It's called a, a tulip uh, flower metal die cutting set. So this is um, from also the August release and I liked how I added some candy in the middle with some little pearls and I've also topped it with some Nouveau drops to make it look extra 3D and also shiny. So um, it's pretty cool and I love these different kinds of candy, especially the gummy bears and these worms. This gummy bear came from um, a prior release um the older years um for the it's like a claw machine kind of thing and it came with these bears i've added some charms here and most of these you could find on aliexpress as well and it comes with these bindings here with the holes and i've put some eyelets on here and binder rings as well as some ribbons. It's really nice that this album, you can um, not glue the whole entire thing, just the sides here, and you can slip things in between. You can add pictures as well. So it's really nice. Inside we have some embroidery patches. Yeah, it's really nice. And some more fall theme related items are these pumpkin shaker tags. Uh, it comes with these words as well as the pumpkin shaker and the tag. And inside you'll see some um, shaker bits and this is also from a different metal die set from also from the August release. Uh, this one is shaped as mushrooms. Here's another one that I made. And this one has pumpkin shaker bits inside. And another one, this one has rain boot shaker bits. The shaker bits, uh, fall shaker bits also has the, we have um, a squirrel too. And I placed it inside this acorn shaker, which is another, which is another, um, August release and it's part of fall theme and you can see here I also used the tulip metal die set for August and it's here and it's really neat the squirrels inside put some sentiments and the, these embellishments are great on any of your projects and great for swaps or happy mail yeah let's see if we have any more um fall related stuff it looks like oh yes we have these uh we have these marsh marshmallow shadow words and this one says warm hugs, marshmallow, 
I like how I made it look like a marshmallow inside some chocolate, hot chocolate. So, and I kind of uh, put some ink on the ends. This one says hot chocolate. Cocoa bar and cup of chair. Moving on to the winter theme, we have a slimline train cutting die set and uh, Hannah made it into a 3D train so I thought okay uh, yeah I'll do the same and she has a tutorial on her YouTube channel if you like to check it out you could it's uh, pretty neat and you connect the cars or you could just make a card out of it and I've placed some cotton in here to make it look like snow and I've placed some kind of and it comes with all these little embellishments there's a tree candy cane present a deer, snowflake, and Rudolph, and a sleigh. These came from my stash, these muffin, gingerbread topped muffins or cupcakes were from my stash. So yeah, you could put a lot of stuff in here and use it like for swaps or happy mail. It's, uh, yeah, you can put lots of stuff in here. It's really nice. We have these, uh, next up we have these penguin metal die sets and I made these penguins. And also from the August release is these uh, banners kind of thing. And it has many different styles. There's like a tree banner and I've decided to use this gingerbread with uh, peppermint hearts. In the middle I used a dome resin and I placed a Palmer clay penguin in underneath the resin and it looks like a, a ice dome. It's really cute. Yeah and I backed it up with foam so it'll look like um, more voluminous and yeah. Next up we have these poinsettia flowers and uh, you could make quite a few with that metal die set and uh, I put some Nouveau drops on there and to make it extra shiny and layered it and uh, put some Tim Holtz distress ink to make it look uh, like it's like uh, shaded a bit so it has some shadows on there and some foam balls. Next up we have this add-on, Christmas add-on for the tier tray so the tier tray comes separately and from previous release and uh, what we have here is uh, I made some tinsel ornaments and it comes with all of these tinsel ornaments and uh, it, from my stash is these tinsel ornament tops um, it does it's not in comes with the it doesn't come with the add-on Christmas uh, tier tray items but um look how many there are and i couldn't fit every single one of them um there's some leftover ones so um but it's pretty neat it has a gingerbread sleigh uh, the sleigh comes with um I think it might have been a bigger sleigh and a uh, dare uh, gingerbread and one gingerbread is like a really big and some candy, peppermint candies, snowflake, Rudolph, 
and uh, stockings and this poinsettia flower it's really useful for like you could put it on many different projects it's not just this tier tray so um yeah i mentioned that there's like extras that um came out of like cutting out from just that one set and i used it for this uh next project here uh this christmas tree mini album see how i added the stocking here on this uh this metal string here well it's possible but it's made to look like it's metal and it's really neat uh, i added some charms here and a binder ring and this tree is originally just this one tree but um, i saw hannah it was really a nice idea you could see on her instagram or on her YouTube, uh, she made it into layers, which I thought it was really neat. And you can check out her channel to see what she did. So I decided to do the same thing, but um, yeah. So here's the layers. You could slot something in here like this, a little memento. And here's another extra charm that I had. This is the bigger gingerbread, I believe. And then um, I've added some magnetic little embellishments to it. This is like a cute squirrel. This is a busy sidewalk collection, paper collection from uh, crepe paper. Yeah, and it sort of kind of, you know, um, puts everything in place and it doesn't fall out as much, you know. Um, so yeah, it's really neat like that here's another layer and here's another one from the tear tray a snowflake you could put photos write things on here put little mementos and little notes in here and you can even use the back too so I haven't decorated the back here's a person doing snow angel seasonal ice skating ticket with uh, these uh, ice skating shoes part of the tiered tray Christmas add-on and uh, finally we have the last page and there's a cat and a person holding lots of presents and there's a picture frame here you can add a picture in here or a photo and uh, oh this is the bigger bigger gingerbread so there's quite a lot of uh, pieces to that set. Yeah, it's really neat. Could tape this in place. And here we have a gingerbread mini album recipe book. It comes with this tray and the word recipe book. The tray is not, uh, it's not, it comes solid. I just uh, cut out the middle here to make it a shaker and put shaker bits in so you could see part of the dress of the gingerbread. And I hanged it on some chain here. You could take this off with this hook here, like, yeah. and. You don't necessarily need to put the tray here. I just did it because um, I want to show it's a recipe book. And you can remove this with this uh, hook. And it comes with these uh, baking utensils. And also this one and the hat. This one is uh, also, this bow is also, uh, the strippy bow is also from Crayos Craft from a previous uh, Christmas release, I believe and um and i added some charms here i made this uh, polymer clay cookie with some icing inside looks like this and uh, you can see that um, it has different faces it includes different facial expressions in here this one is from um i got this uh from chaos craft i bought this like last in last year's christmas release it's uh it's really neat it's uh, it also comes with different um um sentiments and uh, you could stamp it onto the the board and you can slot in 
into this dress or you can paste it and put recipes in here and um, yeah it comes with the slot too the slot here so you can place your recipes and here's the tray that I was mentioning about that solid so I place the recipe and this gingerbread cookies I make it annually every almost every holiday Here's another recipe I have in here. Peanut butter cookies, they taste really good. I made it so many times. Yeah, it's a really nice album. You could refer your recipes all in this one book here, mini album. And you could put pictures of your cookies or whatever desserts or whatever um, recipe dish that you've made you can put pictures for reference it's really neat I'm gonna just I'm gonna print out some photos of my cookies and I'm gonna put it into this album and we also have this what I received from Chaos Craft for the August release is this envelope builder. It comes in two sizes, one bigger and one smaller. This one is the smaller version of it. And uh, all these pictures are from my stash, including this frame that I cut out is from my stash. Uh, I made it clear with acetate with some snow on it. I'm not sure if you can see there's like snow, but um, yeah, it's really neat. Uh, if you turn around at the back, you have this tab. The, send, the receiver could just tear off this tab right across like this and open it up and you have all the different goodies inside. Um, it's really perfect for swaps or happy mail or just, you know, sending a letter in there. It's um, really cute. Up here we see some leaves, these holly berry leaves, and it comes with some berries, but I just covered it with um, these uh, Hershey Kisses. But yeah, it comes with berries and, uh, and these leaves are really cute for um, embellishing your projects as well. What you see in the back here, this wax seal is from the September release and um, it looks really cool. Yeah, so I, I thought, oh, this is letter related, envelope related, and um, it kind of belongs here, sort of, so I put it in. Yeah, it's uh, really easy to um, make this envelope builder, and uh, I believe Hannah has uh, a tutorial on this as well, so um, yeah, go check it out. Finally, we have these gingerbread man bow and uh, these are super cute and I've put some clear rock candy to make it like a sugar coated cookie. It comes with this little small bow and I've used Nouveau drops to decorate it. Uh, I put stripes on here and it looks like it's like made out of uh, looks like a peppermint bow candy or something but yeah I made it so uh, and it's layered these bows super cute with the icings on the side For this one, the eye looks different. I, I believe these eyes were like part of the eyebrow, but I decided to make it into eye. I hope you enjoyed this August cast craft release and I thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Toodaloo.